I was the first in my family to go to university. My family really motivated me to go to university. They saw it as a way for me to break a cycle of poverty. It's an opportunity to kind of fulfill something that, for me, I never thought was possible. Once I started my undergrad, I felt like I was in the place where I was always meant to be. For anyone who feels like they don't belong in university, you do. When I get on campus and there aren't that many people that really look like me and that many people to relate to, that was definitely a little bit of a shock. What changed for me was that I found this academic mentorship program. It sends um, university students such as myself into local high school and middle schools. What we do is we try to coach the youths on how they get to university and also the character traits that they need to succeed as black people. For me, it was just, this is my chance to give back and give to people what I never had. And from that point on, you know, I just volunteered more. I met a lot of new people there and was really starting to enjoy school. Maybe we should have a mid-April trip. Keeps everyone engaged. Um, something that brings the community together. Historically, a lot of our people did not attend university. So our very existence in these spaces is so empowering and so impactful. It was very hard initially coming to university because I felt like I wasn't smart enough or I wasn't capable enough. What really turned things around for me was connecting with the Indigenous Outreach and Engagement program at my campus because it helped me get involved more with my culture. For me, it's important to be at a university that has a really high level of Indigenous scholarship. And then your people tried hard to get you talking. It's helped me explore concepts and methods and theories about my community and about my people in ways that I would have never thought of before. So I sought help and I flourished. My mom is able to say that my daughter goes to U of T and studies kinesiology. She could be proud of me because I'm doing well here. When you're in high school and when you're younger, you're listening to what your parents want you to do, what your teachers want you to do. But once you get to university, you have a little bit more room to find who you are. For me, finding community on campus really means belonging, looking for people that are like me. So going to an Afrocentric event or going to a community where it's LGBTQ2 plus focused and positive. What I've learned is that I belong here because I've worked hard to be here and that society and norms can't tell me otherwise. Going back to school as a mature student, there is this feeling of, what am I doing here? But the power of the learning experience kind of takes over. In my pre-university career, I've, I struggled. Coming to the university was helpful for me because I was able to have access to tools that helped me in a classroom situation. Because of that, like I actually, I wouldn't say like I'm an A student, but I do have a lot of A's. I'd like to be an example to my kids. As proof of that, my son also comes to university as well. For me, having this opportunity at a do-over makes me very happy. Over the moon, I'm over the moon. I was on the streetcar and I would just see all the students walking with their backpacks and some with their U of T jackets on. And I just sort of had this yearning, like I want to be one of them. My 
son was only six years old when I started here at U of T. There's one thing that's, that's the big plus is the family housing. I could live close to campus and have my son and I have our own place. It was a struggle for the first year or two, but I was able to get bursaries from various programs here on campus. First Nations House guided me of what various bursaries were available for single parents. And I started winning um, student awards. You just keep having all these voices telling you, keep going, keep going. It's sort of like when you're running a race and you just hear that those people cheering you on. I think academics is important, establishing a career is important, but personal growth is absolutely priceless. And I don't think you get that anywhere other than being around um, other young people who are also experiencing the same thing.